Well, sorry about that, guys. So we um, we aren't reviewing Prince Albert Matt at Game of Thrones. But does anybody else think that Jonathan Pereira looks a lot like Prince Albert Matt at Game of Thrones? Honestly, I can't get over it. He looks like a fucking replica of him. If there's any Game of Thrones fans out there, let me know if you agree. If you're not a Game of Thrones fan, you probably have a fucking clue what I'm on about, but he looks just like Aubrey Martel. But yeah, as you can guess, guys, welcome to this FIFA Ultimate Team informed on him Pereira play review. And that obviously is a great looking card. Great card if you're a pace abuser. He's got 89 pace, 82 dribbling, 73 shot, 29 defending, 62 passing and 52 physical. Three star weak foot, three star skill moves and medium, medium work rates now in game. As you just saw there, he's got decent stats. 82 dribbling, 90 acceleration, um, 83 positioning and 75 finishing. Now... I think it was three for twelve. This guy was absolutely immense, and every year I've tried him, and every year he hasn't been as good. Now, unfortunately, this inform didn't live up to my expectations. I will say the pros on the guy is obviously very quick. Look at this here, how he gets onto this ball there. You know, he can break away very, very fast, and he's very agile as well, and he's got great balance, so he's very hard at times to push off the ball if you can get in front of the defender. Although I will say his strength is pathetic, man. Honestly, this guy is like a vegetarian, yet he's a fucking stick. His shot is awful as well, but we'll go on more to that. But also his dribbling is really good as well, guys. Um, Obviously, with his good agility, pace and dribbling all mixed in together. And he's got three-star skill moves, so he can weave in and out of defenders. He can move around and make a chance for him. Or his uh, partner, and I will say his partner, Ruben Castro, was a great buy for about 10,000 coins. Honestly, try him out, guys, a cheap Spanish striker. But yeah, other than that, I was very disappointed in this card, to be honest with you. Um, main disappointment is finishing. He kicks like a girl, and no offence to any women, but his fucking shot power and his finishing were atrocious. He couldn't finish his dinner. Look at this game here particularly. Look, that's a terrible finish. He just kept on kicking it to the keeper, and he puts no power in his shots. He can't get any curve. I really struggled to score goals with him, and you know, this was one of the most frustrating play reviews I have ever done. I mean, I literally couldn't put a chance away, and I was getting quite frustrated. The people I played against must have thought, what the fuck, cause I was playing so bad. And another massive no no with this guy is do not shoot with his weak foot, he is terrible. Yeah, his strength is also atrocious, he just gets bullied off the ball. He does have good balance, he does have good agility, but that doesn't really show a lot of times because he's so weak. So, as you can see here, guys, find them pros and cons. Pros, pace, he's very, very fast. Pace abuses dream. He's good for sweaties as well, he's positioning it bad. Great agility, can weave in and out of plays. He's got good balance, you know. Obviously, he gets bullied off the ball more times than not. But there are times when up against maybe wing backs, he can keep his feet and he just nudge them on the floor because of his balance. His dribbling is great and he looks a lot like Prince Obi Martel. Cons, whole shooting, long shots, finesse shots, power shots, finishing. It was all horrible for me. Might just be me, I don't know, but it was absolutely disgusting. Strength, bad. His league, yeah, he's in the uh, Liga Adelante, you know, Spain's second division, so his league isn't so great, although he's Spanish, so you know, I'm sure you can make pretty decent teams. Price is about 180,000. Yeah, he's quick, but I thought it was pretty crap. And first touch, I didn't mention it wasn't very good. But yeah, that's it, guys. If you've enjoyed this review, please like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know what you think. I will be bringing out a different sort of video tomorrow on some Portuguese players, so look out for that. Other than that, guys, thank you for watching. Have a very, very nice day.